Hi guys, welcome back to Miss Clark Does Science. Last time we were talking about active transport, which was the higher level content for this spec. It's the first high level bit we've encountered so far. Today though, we're going to be moving on to enzymes. This is the last part of this unit now. So the first thing you need to know is that enzymes are proteins made by cells to control reactions in cells by catalyzing, which means speeding up, the rate of chemical reactions. That This is a really important statement to remember, especially this word catalyzing. It just means speeding up. So what they do down here is they act as a kind of mediator for chemical reactions to occur. Okay, so delving into this a little bit more now, one of the first things that enzymes are really useful for is building larger molecules from small ones. So here we've got an example of some molecules just on their own in free space and then with the process of protein synthesis they are going to become a fully joined protein and how they do that is by using an enzyme to speed up this reaction okay so the enzyme is kind of like the middleman making this reaction happen so building things together but they are also responsible for breaking things down so breaking down large molecules into small ones. So over here we've got some molecules and they're all joined up by these chemical bonds. This is called starch which is in a lot of our food that we eat and as part of the digestion process we have enzymes that break down starch molecules into uh, their subsequent parts. So into these uh, the same things as before really. So they, enzymes kind of do both jobs. They break things down and they build things up. Okay, so it may sound short, but that's it for this point of the spec. Just remember that enzymes catalyze chemical reactions inside of cells and they break things down and build things up. Next time we'll talk about how they actually do this using this model on the page right now.